Okay, so today we're talking about video editing softwares. Specifically, HitFilm Express and Filmora. The regular Filmora, not Filmora Pro. The reason I was going to talk about these today is some people have asked me which one do I prefer or which one would I recommend. So, we're going to look at the pros and cons of both editors. Okay, editing software number one, HitFilm Express. Let's look at the pros first. So, I'd say some of the pros are advanced editing tools. HitFilm Express comes with countless advanced editing tools, such as masking, tracking, and very advanced color grading. They have, I'd say, about 30 effects for color grading, which will make your videos probably top out there. Also, it has very good exporting uh, quality, which, you know, is always neat when your videos look nice. But now to some cons. HitFilm Express does not have any markers. Oh, really quickly, just to add, this HitFilm Express is completely free. But anyway, it has no markers. The pre-rendering, the pre-rendering, which if you want, don't know what that is, it's when you pre-render something and that is for smoother playback. So, it does not have that, or it does, but it doesn't work very well. Also, it doesn't have warp stabilizer, which is really nice. And uh, it doesn't have built-in presets. But this is also a free editor, so you might want to consider that. And uh, I'd say it's really good at what it comes at. Editing software number two, Filmora. So, Filmora, I'd say, is pretty good at editing software to learn. It has some pretty cool effects. Tons of built-in transitions, effects, uh, color presets. Their pre-rendering works, but the only problem is, you know, the when you pre-render it, the quality goes down by about 75%. So, yeah, you might want to take that in effect. But also, it has markers, all the extra features that HitFilm Express doesn't have. It has all the things that make your video a little more comfortable. The problem is, you cannot edit without an internet connection. You can't export anything, which HitFilm Express has, and it allows for easier workflow. But Filmora doesn't have that. And it says it's free even when it actually isn't. It pays a watermark over your video unless you pay $40. So I'd say don't get it if you think it's free. And also, some of the other problems that I've had with Filmora is that these are pretty good editing softwares in my opinion, but I overall prefer HitFilm hey Express. I prefer HitFilm hey Express over these two editors. It wins this editing software battle. But as I said, Filmora is easy for video beginners. And uh, if you like this video editing comparison, video editing software comparison, you can like like the video. That tells me that you like it. You could figure that out probably. But uh, if you like want more informative videos like this, subscribe because then you know it'll appear in your subscription box and maybe even click notifications so you'll actually see when the video arrives but uh, i should stop plugging my youtube channel and uh, i post one video every tuesday 